Hey everyone, welcome to another Make and Take Craft. Today we're going to make some cute little corner bookmarks. You can just stick these on the corner of a book. We've got some monsters and then just some pretty designs. All you need today is a packet from the library, or you can do this on your own as long as you have a square piece of paper, and some scissors, and that's it. So let's get started. So the first step to make your little origami monster bookmark, corner bookmarks, is to cut off this green side of your paper if you're using one of the templates that the library is giving you. If you're just using a regular piece of paper, you just need to make sure that it's a square piece of paper, so origami paper would work, or you can take a regular 8 and a half by 11 and fold it and then cut off the edge too. Um, if you want and you don't want to watch the video game, again, this is a good instructions on the side, so hold on to it but it's really simple. You just cut that edge off and you can put it aside and you can put your scissors aside. So now we're just going to do some folding. So you want to start with the blank side facing up and you're just going to fold your origami paper in half like that. Then you're going to open it and you're going to fold it the other way in half. So you will get like a cross in the center. Try to get the sides as, a lot, as lined up as possible um, and try to make your folds really sharp because that will help us later, okay? So then you open it up again. Now we're going to take this side, this corner, and fold it up to here. And we know that's the side because it's our monster face. So you want to take, you don't want to fold your monster face in half. So you want to take this corner all the way up to the top. And there's our monster. See, he's very cute. There's a monster on that side. And there's a monster on that side. So once you've done that, you're going to open it up again. And then you're going to take this corner to the inside line. So you see this inside line right here that we folded? We're going to take this corner and we're going to have him meet right there. And again, really sharp creases as much as possible. And we're going to do it to the other side. So this is, you're going to take this corner and you're going to meet in the inside. Like that. And then we're going to fold the whole thing in half. And I'm going to make it, try to crease it again there. And there's our monster. There's our monster. So we're going to make it so that our monster is looking, is, so the short side is facing up here. So he's kind of looking at us. One of your monster faces is going to be covered. That's okay because it's only going to be on the one side. It's not going to be on the back. You can sort of see him in there. But So you're going to take this corner and you're going to fold it along this line here. Okay sort of looks like a leg and then a really good crease again so this is how it's going to look for you okay and then we're going to do the same thing with this corner so you're going to take this corner and you're going to fold it in if you watched miss jenny's origami frog video we do this at a point this is a very kind of common technique for that now you're going to flip it if you want to add glue or tape, you could put some on these edges right here. I'm not going to. You don't really need to. But what you're going to do is you're going to kind of open him up. You see the pocket right here. You see the pocket? And then we're going to tuck his legs into that pocket. So we're going to fold it and kind of tuck his legs in and give him a nice sharp crease like that. Okay? And if you had glue or tape, it would stick to the inside. So you're going to take this, you're going to fold it in, and get it nice and flat, as flat as you can. Tuck it in, a nice sharp crease, and you have made a little monster bookmark. Every pack at the library comes with four different kinds of monsters and a different pretty 
kind of patterned bookmark at the end. So you can stop by the library and pick them up. And we'll see you next time. Have a good Halloween. Bye.